How's it going YouTube? It's your boy Ron and welcome back to another episode of our Pokemon Stadium 2 walkthrough series. In the previous episode, we had one of our greatest challenges in going up against Morty from the Ecritique Gym. We were able to succeed in that and now we are going to be facing off Jasmine, the Olivine Gym Leader. And as we will see, she is actually the only trainer we have to defeat for this episode. If you guys recalled and played um, the Gold, Silver, Crystal series, you will recall that she is the only trainer that you face in both the original and the remake. So pretty much enticing to what is on the console version, we will be just going up against Jasmine, the Steel Type Gym Leader. So let's just get started in picking out our team for today. Let's see. So of course Steel Types, they're going to be weak to really fire ground ground types and the types that we'll be seeing today we're definitely going to be needing some of those uh let's see i'll, I'll go ahead and bring lapras sure for alligator why not it's only going to be her I don't remember too much of her team however her main star pokemon is going to be steelix like how it was in the handheld it's the anime um that's just who we know it's going to be 100 percent going to be in the field in terms of other choices to make of course, it's not just going to be steel types. We'll just see a few other Pokemon thrown in for variety. Yeah, let's see. And in terms of this, and for the last Pokemon, let's see, is there anyone else I normally would it bring? Sure, Magneton. Alright, so let's just get started with this team and hope for an easy victory. Um, I'm Jasmine. Pleased to meet you. So we have four steel types to deal with and possibly Corsola or Manting, both water types. Um, obviously, Steelix will be one of them. In terms of another choice to make, Let's go ahead and bring out our own Magneton. Uh, let's go with this team. The challenger has moved on to Olivine Gym. The only opponent here is the gym leader, Jasmine. How will the challenger fare against Jasmine's powerful field type Pokemon? Alright, let's see. Only reason I did want to bring Magneton was because of Mantine and Corsola, but Skarmory is a good choice, it is electric. However, I am skeptical that it may change simply because it will have Steelix. I'm gonna see if it will. Yeah, okay, should have should have predicted that. Oh, an abrupt Pokemon win! Of course, obviously Steelix um, being resistant oh, to electric type moves it was the obvious choice for it to switch. I should have anticipated that. That's okay. Here's the first move. That had no effect. What impact will this Pokemon out, have on the battle? I'll bring out Slowbro just because it has bulky defensive stats. It'll be a better Here comes the Pokemon arms. Switch. Oh, it's Slowbro! Shouldn't do too much. What now? A light hit! And I'll go ahead and How will go this Pokemon surf. Switch affect the flow of battle? Ride that, sir! It's super effective! Yeah. What's next? That was a glancing blow. The Go white ahead with hot battle switch to knock it out. It's ah. her last poke that I'm not too 100% on. Yes, it's a hit. I would hope for course yes, losing so going down. Magneton should be able to easily take it out. Which Pokemon will join the battle now? In fact, her own Magneton is gonna scare me a the little bit. The Pokemon emerges from the Pokeball! So I brought back out Skarn. I'm going to assume her last the isn't. The action continues! Oh, Magneton simply because if it was going to, it's going for fly. Whoa! It blew up high! It's just gonna have to... There's the attack! 
that. No, that didn't connect. They're both hanging tough. How's that? Yeah, the hit this should take this right one off. pretty easily. This should do about half. What do we do? Hit! That was good! Being part steel, it's just gonna do a hot battle amount of damage. Is unfolding. We're just gonna go for it again. And it's gonna go for flying again, so we're just gonna keep wasting it. Just wasting it. Just wasting it. Just wasting it. What this? Oh, that's a miss. I doubt even this fly will not get out. Didn't do too much damage the first time. I didn't check how much. Oh, never mind. Okay, it was enough. That's a hit. But that's fine. I am just gonna bring out magnets on deck. I don't know the last one. But it shouldn't be. The Pokemon appears with a cross. But if it is Corsola, that's fine. It's the fierce attack. This should not get out though. Magneton does have a healthy amount of special what attack. It's not very effective. Do anything with Magneton's new steel typing, and this should not get out. Wow, thunderbolt! Thrill the weak. Yes, it's going down. There's only one Pokemon left to come up. Oh, and it's course It is It's course it is. down to the last Pokemon now. The yeah, number so of remaining knock Pokemon it out. is two to one. Thunder should be enough to knock it out. However, I believe I sh should be careful because Corsola can learn Miracoat. If this doesn't knock it out, this may. Oh no! Success! What I was going to say is if it did have Miracoat, um, of course it does double the damage on any special attack moves done to the user, um, done to the victim, excuse me, and that would have been very bad. However, that wasn't the case. Simple enough. Perhaps I should step down as gym leader. But that is all of my gym. Now, it is a very short episode, I know, unfortunately, with every new gym leader we face, um, we will have to save it for the next episode. However, since it doesn't do it here since I already finished round one, I do want to mention that if we had not cleared it, we would have to face, of course, Team Rocket. As we see here, um, Team Rocket impedes our progress, doesn't play the cutscene. Um, once I hit round two, we will be able to see the cutscene properly. However, Kind of like in the original games, um, Team Rocket is the one that stops you from pretty much continuing on the normal game path. And just as in Pokemon Stadium 2, they are interrupting us and now we have to go against them. However, as I said, we will be saving that for the next episode. Today's was short, only being Jasmine. But of course, once we face the next episode's Team Rockets, this one will be a little bit longer. So just to kind of make up for it. But as always, guys, thank you so much for watching today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. And thank you as so much as always for continuing along in our series. Until the next episode when we have to now go against the Team Rockets. Until um, then, peace out.